everyone, and welcome back to Chapel. We are so excited to begin our new in-person services, our regathering, what we're really calling it, on June 14th. What I'd love to do is just walk you through what that experience is going to be like. For those of you who are not ready to join us just yet, we are creating a new live stream experience, which is going to be starting on June 14th as well, so you can join us live online through the Chapel website at www.chapelcares.com. For those of you who are gonna be coming in person, I'm gonna take you through a step-by-step -step tutorial of what it's going to be, because it is going to be a little bit different. The reason why is because we wanna maintain your safety, we wanna maintain distancing, uh, we want it to be coordinated, which is going to be why we require pre-registration. And we also have to have someone check at the front door that you are registered so that we can have the right seats set aside for you and your family. It's very important to us about maintaining safety, but we really, really are excited about you coming back. So I'm gonna take you through that in the next few minutes, and I realize it's going to be a little different, but uh, that's okay, we'll get through this, and, uh, and I think you'll adjust very, very quickly. All right, the first step, when you arrive at chapel, you will be greeted by someone right in this area who will direct you to line up on the sidewalk. At this point in time, we'll be maintaining social distancing and forming a queue line, and you will also be asked to be wearing your mask at all times from here on going forward, unless you have a medical condition. If so, please let us know. When we get up to this point, an usher or a greeter will be asked will ask you to proceed forward right up to the white line up here where you will meet someone from registration and a greeter. You will wait here while they check your registration and let you know what seat you're sitting in. After this, you will step forward once the usher asks you to, to come forward into this area. This area is where you will be met by another greeter. This greeter will wait until either the left, center, or right door is opened up so that an usher may walk you to your seats. Again, we'll be wearing masks at this point in time and maintaining social distancing. We appreciate you uh, taking this consideration and being prepared ahead of time. This way it'll make it very easy to flow through. If for some reason you do forget your masks, we do have extras. And remember, children under two are not required for masks and children two to five are at the discretion of the parents. Once you're called forward, you will move forward to a staging area right here and in the subsequent areas in the next two doors. An usher will then walk you to your seats. You will notice that the sanctuary is set up very differently in order to accommodate social distancing. Every seat and section is separated by six feet. We know this will feel a little different, but it's for your safety and it's in compliance with phase one of the places of worship requirements. We're still gonna worship God. We are gonna learn and get taught by Pastor Derek, and we're so excited to have you here with us. Upon completion of the services, an usher will come forward and release people by rows. And you will exit out the left side of the building, the rear side of the building, or the front entrance as directed by the ushers. Unfortunately, at this point in time, we cannot have any fellowship time, we will not have communion, and the offering will be taken at the end of the service where there will be baskets or little boxes in the back row where you can drop off your offerings upon exiting. We hope that in the near future, things will change and we will be able to move forward. So once you are, uh, once the service is complete and the ushers have you exit, you will come back out through these doors and you'll be instructed to either exit out the entrance on the right or the exit on the left. Pastor Derek will be waiting outside the rear entrance to say hi and uh, to greet anyone who would like to say hi. Thank you, God bless you, and we appreciate your patience through this process.